Nastia, we were just talking, it's a beautiful day out, but more... Take a half step back. Beautiful, thank you. Okay, anytime. More importantly, we're talking today about multi-sport and kids getting out there and being active. Why is it so important to you? Well, for me, I was a gymnast my entire life, and both my parents were gymnasts, but I think the most important thing for kids is to find something you're passionate about. And so, you know, I did try other sports. Obviously, gymnastics is the one that kind of stuck um, for me, but it was... For, it was just something that I really loved doing, and um, but I think it's so important for kids to find something that they love to do that is active. And um, for me, having a healthy lifestyle and being active is still such a huge part of my life, even though I'm not a competitive gymnast anymore. You know, we talk about, unfortunately, the obesity trends that are going on with kids nowadays and kids being stagnant and on computers, on iPhones. It's, I mean, it's so important to deliver this message. What does it mean to you personally that the USDA chose you to help deliver that message? It's definitely a huge honor. Um, I've been a tennis fan for since I was really young, and my dad and I, my dad was my coach in gymnastics, but we also used to play tennis on our off days just to kind of get our mind off of gymnastics, and he actually still plays. He built a tennis court in the back of their house, and he plays twice a day, so he's like, if I would have started this earlier, I could have been really good. I'm like, Dad, I think you're okay. <laughs> um, but so I, um, living in New York, I love being able to come to the Open every year, but to be able to be part of something like this with this message, it's it's really close to my heart because that's something that's important to me. I have my own gymnastics competition and it's really about inspiring the youth because they are our future. And so um, whether it's gymnastics or tennis or another sport, it's all around the same thing. And so it's really special for me. The fact that, that the US Open has used their premier event as a background to have the three of you out here, what do you think about them being the leader? Oh, it's a huge honor for me to be able to be with Layla and, and Ryan. I mean, I, I'm living in New York. I'm a fan of Ryan and the Rangers. And um, obviously with Layla, I mean, she's amazing. And so just to be able to be in her company is a huge honor. And um, it was fun. We got to hit some balls together, too. So it was, it was a fun event with such a great meaning. And last question, you mentioned you come out, you, you've come out here to watch the Open yeah. before. I always talk to people about the mystique and the magic of the Open, whether it's yes. a night match or oh, yeah. talk to me about what it means, means to you. Well, every time I'm able to come out, I probably only get out here one, for one match or something. I'm in school full time at NYU and I'm traveling, but every time I come out here, walking into this stadium and everything, it kind of gives me those feelings when I did, when I walked out into that Olympic Stadium in Beijing and um, same kind of feeling. So I kind of know what the those athletes are feeling and especially once you get closer to the finals and it's kind of that that moment you've been you know not only training for that year but really leading up to your whole life it's all been preparation for this moment and so it's really cool to be here